Hello, good morning to everyone. Welcome back to Act Mathematics Class 12th last quick revision in this chapter. Chapter 3 is matrices. So, what is the chapter 3? In our textbook, chapter 3 is matrices in this class. Class is 12th. Okay. See just just see the let's see the some important quick revision in this chapter. Okay. If A equal to closed A i j of order is n by n then trace of a equal to this is general matrix order closed closed bracket a i j n by n then trace of a equal to sigma i equal to 1 to n a i e equal to a 1 1 plus a 2 2 plus and so on plus a n n okay trace of a equal to sigma sum of sigma i equal to 1 to n a i e equal to you can write you can express this one a 1 1 plus a 2 2 plus and so on plus a n n. So, what is the diagonal matrix definition for a square matrix a equal to matrix is a i j of order n by n to be a diagonal matrix a i j equal to 0 whenever i not equal to j matrices of different orders can either be added nor subtracted addition of matrices is commutative as well as associative see here what is the diagonal matrix diagonal matrix condition is this one where whenever i not equal to j so that matrix is called diagonal matrix here matrices of different orders can neither be added nor subtracted so, what is the properties of diagonal matrix? Addition of matrices is commutative as well as associative. Here, what is the commutative? This one is commutative law. A plus B equal to B plus A. This is associative law. A plus B plus C equal to A plus B plus C. And last one is A plus 0 equal to 0 plus A value is A matrix will get. A plus minus A equal to 0. Okay. Next, multiplication of matrices. So, take general matrices 2 matrices and how to multiplications of these 2 matrices here general matrices is a11, a12 and so on, a1n, a21, a22 and so on, a2n and so on, so on, so on, so on. last row, last row is am1, am2 and so on, amn of order is m by n into second matrix is elements are here general matrices is this one second matrix also this one elements are b b11 b12 b and so on b1p and so on so on, so on. last row is b1 and b1 and 2 and so on bnp of order is n by p here order is then these two matrices you can multiply you will get the another matrix of order is m by p m by p so, what is the conditions for multiplication of matrices? Number of columns equal to number of rows in the nth matrix. Right? Here check it. So, n n is same. So, we will get after these two matrix multiplication of order is finally you will get nth matrix that order is m by p. See here m by p that is the main that is the main condition for multiplication of two matrices. Okay. So, where C i j equal to a i 1 b 1 j plus and so on plus a i 1 into b and j that equal to sigma k equal to 1 to n a i k b k j values where here i equal to 1 to 3 and so on I am j equal to 1 to 3 and so on p. Okay. So, this is the general general matrices for multiplication. Next, note commutative law does not necessarily hold for multiplication of matrices. If A B equal to B A then matrices A and B are called commutative matrices. If A B equal to minus B A then matrices A and B are called anti commutative matrices. The product of a row matrix of order 1 by n and a column matrix of order n by n, n by 1 here 1 by n, n by a 1 is as 1 by 1 matrix will get. The product of row matrix of order this and a column matrix of order n by 1 will get the 
answer matrix is 1 by 1. The product of a column matrix of order is n by 1 and a row matrix of order is 1 by m is a matrix of order m by n. It is possible that A B is defined, but B A is not defined. So, okay, when A B and B A are both defined, A B may or may not be equal to B A. These are the product important nodes. Those are the okay. Next, if A is the square matrix of order n, then A power m you can write as A into A into A into A and so on m times. Okay, A power R plus S you can write as a power r exponential r in the power in the exponential you can write a power r into a power x okay and a power r whole power x equal you can write a power r x where r and x are indices here matrix multiplication is associated to that is a b into c equal to a into b c just interchange the brackets that is the associated law matrix multiplication is distributed with respect to addition that is a into b, b plus c equal to a b plus a c and a plus b into c equal to a c plus b c. The matrix is possesses diverse of 0 that is if the product a b equal to 0 it is not necessary that at least one of the matrices should be 0 matrix. Cancellation draw does not necessarily hold that if a b equal to a c then generally b not equal to c even if a not equal to 0 for a scalar scalar multiplication matrix k into a b equal to k a into b a equal to a into k k b in particular a into minus b equal to minus a b and minus a into minus b you can write a b next one is special matrices so these are the special matrices transpose of a matrix and properties of transpose in this slide you can see what is the transpose of a matrix the matrix obtained from any given matrix a by interchanging rows and columns is called the transpose of a and it is denoted by a dash or a transpose denoted by this one a dash or a transpose just interchange the rows and columns that is transpose of a matrix if a equal to a i j of order m by n and a dash equal to b i j of order n by m then b i j equal to a i j for all i comma j. Properties of mat transpose a dash whole dash equal to a a plus b whole dash equal to a dash plus b dash and a and b, b being comfortable matrix. Next alpha a whole dash equal to alpha into a dash alpha being here scalar scalar means constant a b whole dash equal to b dash a dash a and b being comfortable for multiplication. Okay, these are the properties of transpose. Next one, conjugate of matrix, conjugate of a matrix properties a dash whole dash equal to a, a plus b whole dash equal to you can write a dash plus b dash, alpha a whole dash equal to alpha dash into a sorry alpha a whole bar equal to you can write alpha bar into a bar, alpha being any number. So, a plus b whole bar you can write a bar plus b bar ok, a bar whole bar equal to a only, a bar a b whole bar you can write a bar into b bar, a, a and b are com comparable of multiplications for multiplication right. Next transpose conjugate of a matrix, next one is properties of transpose conjugative, a theta whole theta see here a power theta whole power theta value is a next a plus b whole power theta equal value you can write a power theta plus b power theta properties of transpose conjugative a k a whole power theta equal to k bar into a power theta where k is any number constant number a b whole power theta equal to you can write b theta into a theta symmetric and skew symmetric matrices what is the symmetric a square matrix a equal to a i j is said to be symmetric when a i j equal to a j i for all i and j that is a dash if a dash equal to a then the matrix the given matrix is said to be symmetric matrix if a dash equal to minus a okay then the given matrix is said to be skew symmetric matrix Okay. So, this is the symmetric and skew symmetric matrix and next last one hermitian and skew hermitian matrix. A square matrix A equal to closed 
bracket a i j is said to be Hermitian matrix if a i j equal to a j i bar for all i j that is a a equal to a theta a power theta ok these are the important quick revision in this chapter theme chapter 3 matrices